I just want to say, um, I just spent some time with the Lord and once again, he, uh, gave me his words on what's coming. The Lord is angry right now because his people don't take him seriously. His people don't, they're not seeking him. They're seeking words of men, words and thoughts and ideas of others. And they don't understand that the Lord is God and that his word is written down for us so that we know and we understand but his people do not seek his face. His people will not humble themselves. His people will not call out to him and get rid of their own thoughts and fantasies and their own hopes and desires and dreams and understand that he is Lord. God's word will come to pass. And everyone who fears and who believes in the word of God will be saved. So stop ignoring the Lord your God. Because he's speaking loud and clear. Stop refusing his voice. Stop refu refusing to listen, to hear, to seek, to humble yourselves. The Lord is angry. The Lord is going to bring justice. He's going to take payment for everything that has been done, all the bloodshed. He is going to get rid of the wicked and all that follow the wicked, all that follow the lies, the false hopes, the deception. We are so close and God is so patient and he's sending his servants who understand, who are seeking knowledge above all else, who are suffering to get his voice out to the people. He is being patient. But his patience is running out and it's going to run out here soon. And everyone who refused, even those in the church, will see that he is Lord and that his word is true. He's angry. He's angry. He's tired of being ignored. He's the living God. He gave us what we needed he gave us the rules to follow so that we could be prosperous, so that we could be a holy people, a good people, a loving people, not a people of murder, a people of filth, of wickedness. And we will not listen to his voice. We go to church. We go to church and pretend like nothing's happening and it's okay. You go and tithe. You go and give your money to the churches. But you don't give your time and you don't give your heart to the living God. So he won't take your tithes. He won't take your sacrifices. Repent. Seek the word of God. Seek knowledge. He is speaking loud and clear. Clean your hearts. <laughs>